Hi everyone, I am Srishti and today I will be speaking about how to ask for our wishes from the universe. Uh, many a times we have heard about uh, trusting the process, divine timing, letting go to receive our wishes, right? Uh, even I have spoken a lot about these topics in my channel. Now today I would like to speak about how we should ask for our wishes from the universe, okay? So, uh, we need to consider that the universe is a layman, just like a child, like it doesn't understand anything, okay? And we need to give every specific detail of our wishes, make it very clear so that it is very easy to understand and we need to say that this is our wish, we need to feel it and that is when magic happens. Okay, so uh, I'll just share a few of the examples and instances to make this very much clear. Okay, one example is like, uh, you'll find that when you ask for something and you don't receive the same kind of wish it's like uh, it is said that what is better for us god knows and uh, accordingly it gets a little bit changed or altered that is fine but uh, something happens sometimes it happens that it's drastically different and we don't like it uh, it's okay it's good for us but it's our wish is not getting fulfilled in that case right now how to make our wish get fulfilled in that scenario so um, what happens uh, Another example in this is like you have ordered something online and your a particular order doesn't reach you. Somebody else's order reach you and your order gets reached to somebody else. So it's a mismatch of the energy, mismatch of how you are putting out your wish. So uh, in that case what we have to do is uh, like we have to be very clear and mention that for, uh, for example you want a job. You just say I want a job. You don't mention that what kind of job you want, what is the salary that you expect, what is the uh, like um, particular place that you want, like whether it is in a particular city, in a particular country. So you need to mention every particular detail. If you want a particular kind of, uh, you can say house, you can mention where you want the house, how it should look like, like all kind of specific details. These are for material positions that I'm saying. If you want a particular kind of a lifestyle, you can say that I want this kind of a lifestyle, but you need to be very specific. You just cannot say, I want a good life. Now, good life has different definition for different kind of person. Universe or God is not able to maybe clearly understand uh, that what are you saying it's God obviously but he has to look after so many people you just say I want a good life you don't think about what kind of life you want you do not uh, give away the brain vibes you do not uh, clearly state that what you want you just say I want a good life but inside you just have a thought that okay this is this things must be there but you do not specify it when you ask for the wish right so what happens maybe a good life which is there for somebody else which i gave the example with the uh, online order uh, like which is good for somebody else reaches you and somebody else might have done the same thing and your definition of life reaches them mismatch of energies so to prevent ourselves from that we need to at the very first stage mention that i am looking for this kind of life this kind of a job this kind of a car this kind of a house anything whatever you want in life as a wish you can mention it in specific detail like you want maybe um a four wheeler you just say i want a car now what company car you are looking for you do not mention then that energy wouldn't get aligned with you you know this is all about energy transfer alignment and these are very very interesting and magical stuff many people think like as out like yeah this is not uh, like uh, true this is not real but this is what i have experienced so i'm sharing my experience this is very interesting it's just about energy shifts we are all our energy souls so if soul exists energy exists so these things are all energy transfers nothing else you think something it's a brain it's science it's energy transmission is happening that kind of energy wherever is there is getting mapped with you it's completely telepathy exists telepathy is energy transfer so this is one kind of telepathy with your wish which is maybe there somewhere it may be a non-living or a living thing you can ask for a pet or you can ask for a particular a plant you can ask for a person um, as a relationship anything like it can be a living or a non-living thing but the energy needs to get mapped okay 
so you need to be very specific one more very funny and interesting um, example or experience i would share like how did i understand this okay that this uh, mapping should be done and you should be very very clear uh, when i was uh, very small less than 10 years i don't exactly remember what age i was in um uh, some kind of uh, mythological serial i was watching where uh, in the mythological series you will be finding uh, like um, uh, some asuras are doing some kind of uh, meditation and they are praying for something and suddenly some god comes and give, grants their uh, prayer and gives them their uh, blessing that okay you are granted this wish so uh, there was some kind of asur who was doing some uh, meditation and some prayer uh, with to lord brahma and then uh, he just said that i uh, shouldn't be killed by any uh, man uh, or women or animals like that so yeah, the wish was granted but for some kind of his karma or deeds he was killed by some plant okay so uh, he thought it's by default that plants are standing they don't attack us they are just living like that so it's not possible that a plant can uh, kill me in any way but it can happen that a force of wind comes and the plant falls on the person or on the uh, living being and he dies this can happen so nobody is killing you you are killed by nature okay so uh, this the asura didn't uh, like specify and he was accordingly killed like similar kind of a story so i might go with little wrong with the specifications which i have mentioned because i saw this at a very young age but what i saw when i saw this i was just awestruck and i told my mother that um, ma uh, whenever we have to uh, like ask for any kind of wish no we have to specify otherwise god doesn't understand anything god is uh, like i said that god doesn't understand anything uh, like he can just take it his own way and make up the story and say okay you said this but i thought you were saying this but you didn't say that you were not saying this so we have to say what we want and what we do not want so this was the first time that i uh, like experienced uh, this or got idea of this then accordingly um, i came to know now i am coming to know across these uh, theories of like magic and uh, energy transfer energy shifts and uh, attracting things in your life so these things now i am underst uh, understanding and learning for the last i would say 2 years i am learning about these things but previously i just had a lot of questions that how these things happen this is actually happening uh, like whatever we are thinking or whenever something happened that like when i was uh, looking at to something or some situation after a few days i saw that situation uh, which was there in somebody else's life happening in my life good or bad i think so i was scared actually that is it like whenever i see something or i think about something it actually happens is it with me um, or uh, what is it like i was very much um, curious and very much scared also about this but this is actually uh, true this is a theory this concept is now widely spoken about since uh, now online social medias are so much active these things are being spoken about in different platforms and this actually exists this is complete science and this is not like some kind of scary thing this is science whatever you think our brain waves get or like radiate some energy and it gets mapped with the particular kind of the thing which you are thinking about and it comes into your life or it comes into reality now the way you are thinking the uh, time the divine timing these things also exist uh, we have to like think about it and not get desperate about it we need to just mention everything clearly so that we are sure that okay we have explained it perfectly and then just let it be when it is the correct time for us to receive that god will decide but what we actually want the things to get mapped with us we need to think that clearly okay so keep on attracting your wishes into your life and always stay positive thank you so much take care bye bye